hello everyone welcome to digital doorway youtube channel in today's video i'm going to show you how you can install the hubspot plugin in wordpress and what features are available in wordpress and how you can take benefit from this without even leaving your wordpress website so let's take a look as you can see on my screen i've already had the hubspot plugin installed on my wordpress website and there are two ways of really doing this number one is from hubspot account itself so you click on the gear icon over here and in integrations come to connected app and as you can see my hubs the plugin is already installed so hubspot provides a native integration with wordpress so you don't have to go through zapier or any other third party apps direct integrations are always good because it's of a higher order so click on visit app marketplace and you can select over here WordPress. So this is the WordPress. As you can see, there's also a page dedicated for this and there's a setup guide. Since my app is already installed, so this is grayed out. But you will see a video and uh, the benefits and what all features are available in your WordPress account. So you can set up list, pop-up, forms, you know you can review or add your contacts create different lists there's a whole variety of features available so you don't have to come back to your hubspot account you can do all of this from your wordpress account itself there's also email automation and sending one-off emails which is very nice so so this is one way of doing it the other way of doing it is coming on so if you if you were to install this connect app it's a very straightforward process you just have to connect your WordPress account and get ready to start off. Another way is to come to plugins section. So click on add new to install the plugin and just click over here HubSpot. It's right over here HubSpot. So as you can see, this is the HubSpot uh, plugin. It's already installed and it's compatible with my version of WordPress. So make sure you check this out and the last update was four days ago so once you install this you'll get a tab over here in the navigation bar click over here setup guide and this opens up all the features or the tabs that are included in wordpress so as you can see i'm on my wordpress dashboard i'm not leaving my wordpress dashboard to go back to hubspot account just to set up all of these features i can view reporting i can create contacts lists forms live chat emails and settings so let's take a look at the first one setup guide so they're also supporting us so you can click the view offer and do all of these things so for example if you're starting off you can create a form i already have a form so it's uh, turned on you can set up live chat for example click over here live chat i'm still on my wordpress dashboard and as you can see i'm using a bot on my website do digitaldoorway.com so it's turned on if i want to create a new cre uh, chat flow i can click over here and i can go with chat or with bot any of these so there are templates of bots over here qualify leads bots meetings bot uh tickets bot just like you will have on in your uh in your hubspot account so without leaving your wordpress dashboard you can do all of these you can set up everything you want for example i go with the default live chat next so i i do everything that i will normally do to set up a chat a chat bot for my website right so i'm just going to cancel this one so this was about chat let's go to let's go back to setup guide and look at the second option nurture and convert leads in nurture and convert leads you can check out your contacts create a contact list or send a personalized email I'm going to check out my contacts. So I have all of these contacts which are showing over here. Right. So I can also add a contact. For example, abc at gmail.com. First name is A, second name is B. You know, digital marketing manager, job title.
uh, life cycle stage so you can set up pretty much everything that you want and I can create a contact so it's showing over here and the CRM opens up all the details just like it would on uh, my HubSpot dashboard so you can monitor you can create tickets uh, sorry for that let me just go in again so you can send emails from here you know you can create an email and send it off uh, you can you can create notes you can create tickets you can associate this contact record with a company and if you haven't watched how to do all this there's a video in my HubSpot playlist uh, starting off with HubSpot CRM where I've explained all of these features please go ahead and watch that video I'm just going to delete this so it's very as you can see it's very simple to use uh, just like uh, on our HubSpot dashboard okay now coming to list in the list uh, tab again I have all of these and I can also create an active list or a static list okay and for example if I want to create an active list click over here and select the filter type let's say form submissions I select the form let's say pop up form and I apply the filter so I'll name the list and then save it just gonna go back to list I'm gonna leave this page now coming to forms uh, I can create a new form again in HubSpot you have regular form and pop up form let's say I'm gonna go with regular form and again over here you have uh, pre-made templates which you can choose let's say I go to go with registration I'm going to start this so these are the form fields and you can drag and drop whatever you want and make whichever form field you want mandatory uh, make required uh, make it GDPR compliant right So you need to submit over here and after agreeing so you can pretty much do whatever you want you can create new fields a uh, single line uh, radio for example okay and and then submit this so you will get a short code which you can copy and add it in your page so it's very simple very straightforward to do it I'm just going to go back and over here also you'll find copy short code if you want to and you can share this form you can you also have an embed code if you want to give it to your developer or if you know how to add it by yourself uh, you can view submissions if there are any so it'll show over here what are the submissions in the last 30 days by default and you can change the time range you can also manage the columns uh, create a list of contacts you know you can clone this form delete it if you want to you can also export contacts you can also edit it so it's very simple and in the form you have the follow-up email you have options different options and you have styling over here and you can also preview the tablet and uh, mobile how it looks so just like you would do on your HubSpot dashboard so it's, and then live chat I think I've already shown you uh, you can go to emails next if you go to emails you can create a new email and you can select the template they also have premium email templates which you need to have a minimum of uh, starter uh, pricing plan mine is a free account that I'm showing you so that's why I'm not eligible to use any of these templates so you can send these emails uh, you can choose any of these and start you know sending them off from within the dashboard you can go to settings over here and sending or scheduling I've created an email for this one also I've created a YouTube video for how to use the marketing tool uh, 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 email marketing tool that is of HubSpot please watch that video to understand more and finally I come to settings and you can you can also create forms from here they have kept this option of forms and there's also something called non HubSpot forms uh, submission settings so allow submissions without email addresses so if you don't want anyone uh, if you want contacts to come in even without emails also you can turn it on or off 
by default it's off an account information you have you can create a new account you can disconnect this account and you can create a new user right and if you click any of these it goes back to your HubSpot account for permissions so yeah so these are the prominent features which uh, the WordPress plugin of HubSpot provides it it allows you to work from inside your WordPress dashboard WordPress website without even leaving it when HubSpot started off with this plugin only contacts and list um, tool was available but now since they've updated it a lot of new features uh, have been added and they continue to add more in the coming months and years so that's all for now if you like this video please subscribe to my youtube channel if you have any comment uh, if you want to ask any questions please do leave a comment uh, so that's all thank you goodbye for now